Most people have two kidneys about the size of their fists located in their lower back. Just like your brain or heart, kidneys keep you alive. High potassium is also called hyperkalemia, and it can be serious. Make sure you get regular checkups, and if needed, follow any treatment plan from your healthcare team. You may need to eat foods lower in potassium, such as apples, blueberries, asparagus, carrots, rice, and pasta. You may need to avoid foods higher in potassium. For example, bananas, oranges, tomatoes, spinach, and yogurt. Certain salt substitutes can be high in potassium and should be avoided. A dietitian can help create a meal plan that's right for you. Some diseases can also raise potassium, including diabetes, heart disease, and kidney disease. Managing these diseases can help balance potassium. Certain medicines prescribed by your healthcare team can also help. Potassium binders can attach or bind to extra potassium in your intestines and remove it. Diuretics or water pills help the kidneys create more urine to remove extra potassium. However, they may not work well when kidney function is low. Make sure to tell your healthcare team about any medicines or supplements you take because some of these can actually raise potassium. Do not stop taking your medication unless your healthcare team tells you to do so. The good news is that when it's found early and treated right, the outlook for kidney disease patients can be very bright. <laughs>